This video shows how to test the rear ABS wheel sensor on an E90 318D 2009 part number 6762466. I bought this second hand sensor on eBay but I thought it was faulty. I did some research and decided to put this video together. This shows the pin connections to the two wire sensor. This led to a repair of the ABS reluctor wheel, which is the topic of my next video. I made this simple breakout board to enable me to easily access the two male pin connections. Only the two outer connections are used. I added these markings to the plug to make sure that I knew which pin was which as I did the tests. A diode symbol and a red and black dot are put on the plug. Do not rely on the pin numbering inside the plug. In this section I used the resistance measurement on a multimeter to test the sensor. The first reading was zero and indicated an open circuit which led to my initial disappointment. However, when the meter is connected the other way around the reading is 13 megs. This will differ from meter to meter. I then did another test which showed that there was a diode in the circuit and then open circuit in the other direction. I now felt I was making progress. This shows a simplistic view of what the meter thinks is inside the sensor. However, things are actually much more complicated. There is a very sophisticated Hall Effect 2 wire current sales sensor within the sensor. This is the test setup. It consists of a 12 volt battery. The negative connector is connected to the negative side of the meter, which is set to milliamps. The positive meter is connected to the negative pin of the sensor. There is a 220 ohm resistor connected to the positive side of the battery. This is for protection in case the sensor is accidentally connected the wrong way around. Before I connect the sensor to the 220 ohm resistor, I will show you a schematic of the test circuit. This is the test circuit schematic. Once I connect the resistor to the sensor, I get a reading on the meter of 14 milliamps. The Hall effect I see inside produces two different fixed currents. Here I'm using an old reluctor ring which I removed from the drive shaft. As I move the sensor along the reluctor ring, the current toggles between 14 milliamps and 7 milliamps. There are 48 gaps on the reluctor wheel, so each rotation of the sa shaft produces 48 pulses. This is the system view of the sensor connection to the ECU. In the next video I will deal with the full repair.